This is a well-crafted story. It is alike with the plot of your name. Also mystical involvement just different aspect. But same choice for them to conquer their love for each other. So we give a 9 out of 10 for story. And guys please don't run away on home. The visual here is superb. Like your name, it is amazing animation. You can feel their emotions. By looking into their facial expression and tied up with amazing voice acting. So for visual and voice. Ah, the perfect 10 out 10. Wow. Like your name. This is a perfect film by Makoto Shinkai. Maybe we could have a Shinkai universe because of the cameos of your name characters. So overall rating of the movie. Well you know it. It is perfect 10 over 10. Even though the story is as same of your name. Because of the great dialogue, visual animation, and voice acting. Makes me cry unlike your name. The story starts telling how Tina become a sunshine girl. Her mother is very sick. While there is a non-stop raining outside. But looking the window she saw a pool of sunlight on the rooftop. And of course she go there. And there is a shrine on the rooftop. Then poof she dream of getting into the sky or is it? Moving on. We going to meet the boy protagonist, Hodaka, who run away on their island because he become sick of it. Never do it younglings. The rest of the scenes are about how he struggled to find a job and sleeps in the road. So he makes contact with Suga to work for him. Where they specialize in publishing about urban legends. So on work Hodaka meet Natsumi, Suga's niece, but Hodaka thought she is a mistress. Wow and he look at her boobs. On their investigation they meet a psychic who tells about sunshine girl who can control the weather. After that on very convenient moment, he show Hina dragging in shady club hosts and saves her. Well at first Hina is angry on helping her. But eventually they become friends and Hina shows her power of weather. And that when Hodaka knows the sunshine girl is 100% sure. Because both of them needs work. They thought of something to make profit. So they use Hina's power in Tokyo's weather condition and put up their blog site. One scene when they are helping or you can say profiting, they meet Taki, boy protagonist in your name. Well I hope there is a universe in this anime. And also have a cameo of Mitsuha, girl protagonist in your name. And after all those years they do not know each other name. Wow oh wow. On the other hand, Keisuke and Natsumi continue their investigation about the sunshine girl. And learn that the sunshine girl needs to be sacrificed in order to have nice weather in Tokyo. And do you think that this is a happy story? No no no. Because of Hodaka action of running away. His parents filed a missing person and police are finding him. And Hina got involved since both of them including his little brother, Nagi are both minors. Also Hodaka got fired by Shoga since police thought he kidnapped Hodaka and he is currently filed for a custody of his daughter. So will Hodaka returns to his island? No no no. They run away. And because Hina is not yet sacrificed, the weather turns harsh. They end up getting a night in the hotel. And Hina tells the truth of her power to Hodaka. And what would happen to her? Of course Hodaka refuses that idea. But Hina still sacrifice herself. So after he finds out Hina sacrifice herself and caught the police. Hodaka stops now. Just kidding. Of course he run away, and go to the shrine where Hina got her powers. Hodaka jumps into the shrine and transport it above the sky. Where of course he saw the Hina. Both of them hold hands says this amazing line who cares if we can't see any sunshine? I want you more than any blue sky? So are you crying now? So after coming back to the mainland. Three years passed and Tokyo submerged. How about our protagonist? Well Hodaka graduates from high school. Ye college time. Well no. He is going to Tokyo, oh yes to Hina. So fixing the words to say to her, on his way to her house. 
he sees Hina praying and the two are reunited at last. So this the plot. Wow. That's all folks. Don't forget to like, subscribe and comment below your thoughts about the movie. You can comment your favorite line in the movie. Bye bye.